over to a new place today. This is my first video, so uh, you'll have to uh, bear with me while I get used to it. But uh, I am very excited about this place. It's a house probably 125 years old. Uh, I got permission for it to do it, uh, to metal detect it. Uh, over an acre lot. Beautiful old house, one of the oldest houses in town. And uh, they actually had a picture of it inside the house on the wall that showed a horse and buggy under the portico of the side of the house. Now, I'm going to put a picture of the house on there. I'm not going to tell you where it is. I'm going to put a picture of the house on there and uh, let you see that. And uh, just imagine under that portico, uh, horse and buggy stand there with the uh, all loaded up, ready to go. It's just amazing. But uh, it's a beautiful day. This is uh, uh, Rick uh, digging in the Tennessee mountains. And uh, I'll get back to you and uh, we'll uh, go on this journey together. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in a bit. Well, I'm here here at the house here. Just wanted to kind of give you an idea of what it looks like. Beautiful old place. And uh, I'm itching to get started. So uh, there's the portico off there in the distance. You can see on the left-hand side of the house there. That's where the horse and buggy were. But uh, this is Rick signing off for now. I'll get back to you when I find something nice. Bye. Back here at the old house there. Uh, I've been digging for a while. I think this place has been gone over before. But uh, finally come up with a decent signal here right next to the sidewalk, you can see. All about six, four inches down. And I took it out already. It's sitting on top of the pile right there. It's a uh, big penny. And uh, it's uh, 1918. I kind of looked up the date on it. But that's my first good find. Uh, everything else has been slim pickings up to now. So I'll get back with you the next find. Signing off. Uh, Tennessee digging down in the South Tennessee here again back. Uh, I'm back again and just had been three, four minutes since I talked to you last. Uh, right there's the uh, penny I dug a minute ago. About uh, three foot over to the, uh, right along the sidewalk there. I said there's the house. Coming down the sidewalk, I'm going to the other side of the sidewalk. Uh, got a little signal there. About six inches down at some roots. And guess what that is? That's a 1917 standing Liberty Quarter Type 1. I am excited. That is fantastic. Uh, I, am, I am pumped. So things are starting to look up here. We're doing good here and uh, we're going to keep on going and see what we got. Uh, but that's a pretty thing. Look at that. Pretty, pretty, pretty. I'm not going to wipe out anymore, but I can see it's a 1917. That's that's a nice one. Uh, but anyway, uh, look at that. I know you coin diggers out there probably get as excited as I do. I've been doing this for 30 years. I I never get I never get tired of it. But anyway, uh, there it was right there. I'll uh, I'll get to eat the next find. Signing off for now. Well, guys, I'm out here in the yard still. Still uh, make another swipe alongside the. Uh, uh, driveway, or not the driveway, but the uh, sidewalk, and uh, got a little signal here. What a surprising signal! It uh, rang up as a uh, penny dime, uh, and guess what was in the hole? Uh, just maybe you might be interested in seeing that. Ah, that kind of makes my day once again. Blew my mind, matter of fact. Uh, that pretty thing. I think it's a 1947 model. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to wipe on it. It's beautiful. Uh, it's my first half this year, or second half this year. First uh, walker, but uh, she's beautiful. I love it. Uh, words can't describe how much I like this kind of stuff. Uh, anyway, uh, it was about, uh, you can see, about four inches down. And, uh, Surprised me, big surprise. Couldn't believe it. Anyway, uh, uh, I love it. This is uh, Rick signing off for now to the next find. Bye. Uh, I'm back again. Uh, this is kind of a, a semi-live dig. Uh, 
I've got a signal reading about a quarter in the uh, dirt claw there in the uh, plug. Uh, it may be clad, it may not even be a quarter, but uh, it does a pretty good signal. And uh, so I'm going to kind of expose it with you guys live here. I'll just kind of show you where I'm at. There's the house. I'm still working the, the right side of this sidewalk here, real slow and easy. But uh, I'm going to kind of filter through this with my fingers until we get across this thing. Y'all can kind of watch. Sorry, uh, you're getting any background noise or whatever. Not my intention, of course. But uh, we'll see what we got here. And it's a quarter. Unfortunately, it is a clad quarter. Uh, anyway, uh, when you when you're digging in this yard, you just got to get excited. And anytime you get any kind of signal, that's about four inches deep. So uh, anyway, uh, I still take it and uh, go on to the next one. You guys, uh, stay with me. Rick back again. Uh, I uh, still hanging around here on this side of the yard and uh, got me a signal. Uh, Dug me a wheat penny right there. It's a plug. I put it back in the ground. I went back out, put the plug back in, uh, and ran across it again. I got another signal. They were kind of close together, about uh, four or five inches apart. Actually, half the plug I just dug uh, uh, had part of the other plug in it. So. Uh, Anyway, good to go back over those plugs. You guys know that. Uh, anyway, uh, here's what I found. There's a little, uh, little uh, rosy belt dime. I haven't looked at it. I just know it's a rosy belt. I can tell that. But uh, anyway, uh, good little find. That's three silvers for today and some wheat pennies and a few clad and everything. But uh, it's turned out to be a fun day. And I'm just getting started. So uh, stay with me. Uh, this will be a... Uh, fun adventure for both of us, all of us. Thanks for watching. See you later. Uh, unfortunately, uh, after that last uh, section I put on there, my uh, battery died on my cell phone. Uh, the best uh, hole I dug uh, was, had yet to come. Uh, I actually uh, got in one uh, hole had uh, had four pieces of silver in it. Uh, I was having a great day. But anyway, I'm going to kind of wrap it up for you here. Uh, found that beauty. Uh, 1904 Barber. A 1917 Type 1 uh, Standing Liberty uh, Quarter. A 1926 Standing Liberty Quarter. S-Mint. 1942 uh, Washington. A 41 and a 42 uh, Mercury, a uh, 48 uh, Roosevelt, 43 P Silver Nickel. So a nine silver day for me today. Wonderful. Here we have, uh, uh, that's a uh, 1905 uh, Indian Head Penny. And I got, uh, I'm not going to go through the dates, but I got, uh, looks like three, six, ten, ten uh, wheat cents. Uh, here's my clad down here at the bottom. Over here is three zincs, three zincons. And the uh, other stuff I found there, relics and whatnot, that looks like a li lipstick tube, a couple uh, rifle uh, casings. There's a lead World War I soldier, a key, and a child's bracelet it says James on it. Don't think it's silver, I think it's just a. Uh, a junk little uh, little bracelet, but it was it was a nice little find. Other than that, but uh, I really wish I could have got it all on tape for you, because uh, or recorded it all for you. But uh, my battery unfortunately died. But uh, I kept on pulling silver out of that one hole. Four pieces of silver in one hole. Uh, really great day, uh, and I have just barely scratched the surface of this place. So uh, if it uh, stands. Uh, the rest of the time I go over there is anything like today. This could be a wonderful relationship with that yard. Uh, I just really had a good time. My back's about ready to break. I've been out there for seven hours. Uh, so anyway, uh, uh, just wanted to uh, share that with you. Like I said, uh, 
my video uh, 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 career has just started. It's my first one, so uh, uh, it'll be a learning experience. But uh, but it's a good one to start on, isn't it? Uh, really nice. I mean, I really I really like that right there. I really do. What a wonderful, 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 wonderful. Especially that Type One that Standing Liberty, Standing Liberty uh, quarter. That thing is just awesome. If I can get that to focus. Yeah, you can focus. Anyway, well, anyway, uh, more to come, guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, hope I get it uploaded. Everything looks good and everything on it. But uh, uh, there'll be more coming where this came from. So you, y'all, take care. Good luck and happy hunting. Signing out. See you next time.